Open Streets is a, an event in Minneapolis where they shut down uh, a stretch of street and close it off to car traffic um, and open it up to the community. The Minneapolis Bike Coalition is trying to raise awareness about uh, Bike Ways for Everyone, which is a campaign that we kicked off this past year, uh, trying to get the city of Minneapolis to construct 30 or more miles of new protected bikeways in the city. Our prote protected bikeway is more than just a bike lane. It's a dedicated space on the street for a person riding a bicycle that's physically separated from moving car traffic. And it gives people a sense of comfort and safety as they bicycle down the street. In a more urban environment, that can be an on-street facility where you have a bike lane with a barrier like bollards or uh, a curb or a planted median that separates bikes on street from car traffic. Protected bike lanes are a new concept in the United States. There are some challenges that go along with it. Uh, it requires a little more space than a typical five or six foot bike lane. So what we're demonstrating today is this new concept called protected intersections for bicyclists. That actually shows how a cycle track or protected bike lane goes into an intersection, transitions through the intersection, and allows a person on a bicycle to continue their trip, either going straight ahead through the intersection or turning right or turning left. It increases the visibility of that person as they go out into the intersection uh, for people in cars as well as on bikes to see that person crossing the street. For a lot of people it's, uh, it's something new and the reaction is often, uh, this is so great, this is, I feel so much more comfortable. If we had something like this in my neighborhood I'd be so much more likely to ride with my kids. We've been hearing a lot of positive comments as people bike through this demonstration and people are really excited about this concept and there's a lot of momentum building uh, both within the city and the county uh, to invest in that type of infrastructure.